Learn to move on. I've got some bad news. Life is unfair. We're still. It has its own schedule. That's right. It has its own agenda. It's not going to wait around for you. It's just going to keep on keeping on. This is why you can't always get what you want when you want it. Accepting your flaws and allowing self-love to flower in your life and empower you requires learning to move on. Learn to accept what you can create and what you can influence and what you can't. Be at peace with this. The worst thing that you can do to yourself is to think of yourself as some sort of victim that the world owes all sorts of favors to. I've got some more bad news for you. The world doesn't owe you anything. Everybody's got enough problems of their own. Life truly is unfair, chaotic, and in many cases filled with all sorts of suffering. Now, you really have two choices at this point. You're more than welcome to beat yourself up as to why the world isn't what you think it should be. This path burns up a lot of time, effort, and energy, and oftentimes, you're more frustrated than you began and have very little to show for your efforts. The other path, of course, simply means acceptance. Accepted life isn't fair. People can be mean. Bad things happen to good people. And on and on it goes. Once you've accepted all of these, resolve to move on. This doesn't mean that life has defeated you. This doesn't mean that you have become some sort of cynic. Instead, this is a moment of learning. It's a moment of truth. You learn to accept what you can create and what you can influence. That's the best you can do. In other words, instead of feeling powerless because of all this chaos outside of you that you cannot really control, your eyes are now open to the things in your life that you can control because there will always be at least a few areas in your life where you have a lot of say. Focus on those. That's how you move on. You move on by focusing on what you can create, control, or influence. You may not be able to control the economy, but you can control how hard you work. You may not be able to control whether your boss would be eager to promote, but you can control the value you bring to the table as far as work is concerned. Focus on what you can control or influence and then let go of everything else. This has a paradoxical effect because when you do that, you feel more empowered. This really should not be a surprise because you free up a lot of the emotional energy that you used to burn up, worrying about stuff that you can't control. You then redirect all that energy to the things you can take care of in the here and now. This is how you discover the freedom and joy in moving on. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.